There's a tactical team in the valley trained for high risk incidents. And that team responded to this past weekend's incident at La Paz Mall in McAllen. Channel 5 Cecilia Gutierrez spoke with an agent who says this isn't the first time they've been deployed. BORTAC is a special group of agents who, through intense training, is prepared to respond to emergency and high risk incidents. In the Rio Grande Valley, the Border Patrol Tactical Unit is known for their operations in the field. But on Saturday, those operations were put to the test. We uh, responded as a supporting agency to support the McAllen Police Department with anything they needed. BORTAC Commander for the Rio Grande Valley, Agent Marco Ponce de Leon, says BORTAC is one of the leading active shooter response teams in the nation. Basically, BORTAC is what a local SWAT team is to a police department, except that we're at the national level. As soon as BORTAC agents got the call of a possible active shooter, they suited up and got ready to go, but it didn't take them too long to get there. You see, their headquarters is right across the street from La Plaza Mall. So we were there within minutes. Tasked with responding to possible active shooter events, national emergencies, and high-risk tactical operations, BORTAC is often called in for incidents like Saturdays. The local law enforcement agencies, uh, we do a lot of training, a lot of joint training with the uh, Department of Public Safety uh, SWAT team with the uh, Rio Grande Valley alert team as well. He says their mission was to make sure everyone made it out of the mall unharmed. So that was our sole responsibility at the time. He says the intense training these agents go through prepared them for Saturday's events. They train in uh, active shooter situations, uh, high risk, uh, emergent uh, type of situations. Agent Ponce de Leon says they're always training, so if the need arises, they're ready to respond. Agent Ponce de Leon also says the unit is, un is unique in that they conduct training operations in the United States and other countries. In the studio, Cecilio Gutierrez, Channel 5 News at 6.